Hey guys, and welcome back to my fifth video on JW Plays. And today we're doing something a little bit different. We are doing a 10,000 coin squad builder. And this is for people, obviously, it's team of the year at the moment, so people who are going to be spending their money and get addicted to packs, and then just it's gone. And then you're sitting here with like 20k thinking, ah. I need to make a team to get back up. So, this is like that. Perfect for you. And also, it will be custom tactics and player instructions on this as well. But, it's a, it's an overpowered team. It's a very, very OP. It's unbeaten with me. So, you know, I did well. And I think I've been doing like Division 3. But obviously, I don't play Divisions that much because I've got foot champs. And I can guarantee you, guarantee, that we'll be doing a 12,000 FIFA points pack opening Woo! on Sunday or Saturday because that's when all of the team of the years will be out. And today, the midfield was released, so Modric, Cruz and Iniesta. So, you'll be looking forward to that. So, this is the team. It's, pretty, it's you know it's pretty nice. It has uh, it's a link between um, Liga Santander and Acacia, and I don't really know the reason why I did that. I just did really because you know everyone was OP. The midfield, it's solid attack. It's good at finishing. I mean, Eder is five for ten, but he can he sure can head a ball very well. The fence is solid. So let's get into players. And go we have Sirigu. Five games. Ah, uh, I think in Eclipse you'll see he does pull off some unbelievable saves. He's like Jack Butlin, but a little bit, little bit down. Because obviously Jack Butlin's like 4k, but he's still a solid keeper. I um, just recommend him because he's six for four. That's all you need on a keeper. He's got good diving, good reflexes. That's really all you need. And um, position, obviously, but to have you know, it's good for a goalkeeper. And then right back, we've got Abate, who he's had a bit of a downgrade from previous FIFAs. You know, a little bit less pace, but he's just he's just sick as well. He's fast, he's quite tall. I mean he has got high attack and work rates, which isn't the best, but when you have Sebak on attack him, sorted. Um and obviously I I, I did some last video, so I might as well do it now. Sentinel will be good for him because he's already got the pace and he's got dribbling and all right passing, so he's good for right back. Then at centre back, we have got Tonelli. Who is, again, he's OP. I mean, that's what made us team. It's so overpowered. It's just, it's just so good. Tonelli, six foot, nice height. And maybe a tad too small. Tad too small? Tad, tad um, small. But he's got good high defensive, low attacking, which is always good. And he's got decent pace, good defending and good physical. And I think an anchor would be best for him, you know. Uh, he just got such a nice beard. It's like it's so well groomed, and then you've got his hair. It's, I mean, his hair is, it looks a little bit too much gel, but you know we can't always be perfect. And in that centre back with no hair at all, we've got Mangala. Oh, he's got some chin hair, but he's sick. Four star weak foot, which you know it's, that's actually pretty, pretty nice. You know, six foot two, high defensive. He's left footed. Anchor would be perfect. Sick physical, good defending, good pace. That's really all you want. And then left back, we have Chamonix last, who obviously you think, why would you want to spend a K on a left back? But he's just sick. He's so, so good. He's got good, you know, look, look at his card. He could be a centre midfield. Uh, you know, he's got pace, he's got dribbling, he's got passing, and he's just a solid card. He's a little, he's a little lean on Messi at left back. Well, that's a bit of an overstatement, but he's still good. That's really all about him. He got he got an assist, which is always good. And then we move over to Prorolo, who oh sorry, that was my phone. And who I have to say, he's I mean he's if you got his SVC card, lucky you because it looks solid. I mean, you think you have to spend about fifty k for that, and that's the deal. Because if you look at his card now, it's pretty solid. He's strong, good weak foot, good. I like he's high attacking, so he'll be, but you know, he's medium defensive, so he's good. But when we go into player instructions, he'll be then sitting nicely where he is. He scored a goal, he didn't really get much assist because he's more of a solid guy. 
Um, and he's got, you know, he could be a centre-back if he wanted to. But he's not, he's a centre-mid. Let me move on to the next player. We have Kondogbia. And he is Pogba. He's like, he's like a cheap Pogba. And he's French as well. And he's a centre-mid. And he's gold. And, yeah, that's why, to be honest. Because he's just, and he's tall as well. He is literally the cheap Pogba. And he's got, I mean, you might think, oh, but he's only scored zero goals, James. And he's only got two assists. That's because he was sitting back more. That's the reason. But if he was up front, he'd be like, boom, 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 boom. So, yeah. And then in camp, you have Sosa, who, again, I'm not saying this about all of them. They're just all OP. And he could be an attacker if you wanted to. Well, he's an attacker because he's a cam. But he just runs around everyone. He's got a high, high, good week for... Yeah, as you see, he got one goal, three assists, and there was always one par where he hit the bar. So he chipped the keeper, hit the bar, bounce on the line, and then it comes and it hit the post. It was just, it was just so annoying. But again, I mean, I, the thing, the key thing about this game is having good weak foot because skill moves aren't as effective in a way on this FIFA. So you know, you have to be having a good weak foot. So that you can cut on either foot and it'll go in. Right wing is Cal... I can't remember. I can never pronounce his name. Channel Shal... Shal... Callahan. There we go. Jose Callahan. Got two assists. So it's alright. But I didn't really use him as much. Because on the left hand side. We had someone with five star skills. So I used them more. But he's... You know. He's got, he's got a good card. Nice pace. Nice dribbling. Nice shooting. And whenever I've used a Calcio Ascord. It's rather him or Quadrado. But he, I feel like he's better than Quadrado. Quadrado, you might be like, cool. But he's got four star weak foot, five star skill moves. And he's only like 1k cheap more. Well, I went for Callahan to deal with it. That I'm joking. But he's, he's just sick. He runs down the line. Nice cut. And I, I think there was a clip in the first one I show where he just runs down the line and just destroys the players. He's just so, 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 so good. And then Striker. We have Adair. And if you look at them stats, five games, eight goals. That's so sick. And he's got good pace, good dribbling, good shooting. That's all you need. I mean, physical's good. But he's got good pace, dribbling, so he can go like in between players. And then his shots just bang and he'll go in. And he's got, I think he's got good jumping. I'm not too sure. But all I know is his jumping will be good in game because he scores lots of headers. And he's shots are just really good as well. And he's got a high tank and so he'll be up front. And on the left side, we've got El Shawawi, who's got good pace, good, very good dribbling for his rating. And he's got, you might be like, oh, he's got 75 shooting, so he's not going to be as good. But yeah, he is good. And he might be like 64 games play. I bring him on as a sub sometimes in, you know, in games when I have a good team and I just, there's no one on the bench because I always have lone players on the bench. So I think he got... So four of them assists were in in this thing, and then two of them goals. And he somehow has got a red card, so I don't ask me how that's happened, but I just know he has. So five star skill moves, he can just be like he can just do anything really. And the good thing I like is when you do a fake Rabona because that just mugs off the player. And he's got good weak foot again, so he can go on any foot, and his cross is really good, so he can whip them into Edda or Kalahoglu. And then he just go bang, and it's a goal. And he's got high attack in. He's not too small, but he's like a nice height. And yeah, so if I go through, I think him would be best for Dead Eye, Dead Dark. No, I say Hunter, Dead Eye, Shadow, Shadow, Catalyst, Anchor, Anchor, Bang. So, now we're moving on to our custom tactics. And for our custom tactics, we want, with speed, we want it to be 88. So, so you know, you have nice build-up play. Because this is this is join, this is behind my favourite formation with the 4-3-2-1. But I did that on my last squad, so I'm going for this. But whenever I play mates and stuff, I normally use this formation. And then, for your passing, you want to just... Just move up to the 55 and keep the positioning on organised. Passing, you want to go up to 65. And then crossing, you want to go up to 80. 
because obviously you've got Edo in the box who can head the ball and he will head it for you. Shooting, you then want to be 50. Free, and you want this to be free roam, free form, sorry. And then this, you want to be 35 pressure. Because obviously you have players near the back and you don't, you know, you don't want them to be putting too much pressure to make gaps. Aggression, you then want to go up to 55. Team width, you want to go to 40 because it's already a wide um, formation, so you don't want it to skip the to you know, go even further or else it will just be all over the place and if in line you want on cover standard so that's the custom tactics now player instructions so left back stay back while attacking right back stay back while attacking two center mids stay back while attacking stay back while attacking and so as you see what, what i was saying when they both have high attacking you know they can drop back and then this is key this is the playmaker of the team sosa you want him to be free roam so he'll go all across the field like all around here and then play balls through don't mind if i do and then with the left wing and right wing you want it to be go and get behind uh, get in behind and get in behind and striker he's fast well, it's 85 pace so he's going to be fast you want get in behind and that's it so that's all for the team now I will show you the actual highlights. And just before we get into them, thank you for the views and likes all my videos have got so far. I mean, I've got 33 subscribers and they've all been averaging around 100, well, two of them are on 100 views. One of them's on 80 and one of them's nearly on 500. Uh, so thank you very much. And yeah, we will be going into this. So you'll be seeing pack opening this weekend you'll be seeing inform jamie vardy road to glory next week because i'm waiting for all the team year to make everyone's prices drop and then i'll be able to buy him because i've said i've got enough money at the moment but i'm just saying i'm because i have a different account for it because i weird sign a rose glory in division like three and i'll be doing a 50k squad builder towards the end of team of the year because that's when people will be building some of their money back up and then a little bit after that i'll be doing a 500k squad builder which hopefully from my team of the year i should make enough money to ha do have make that and do the jamie vardy rose glory so we'll go into the highlights now i'll see you so as you can see we're now in the highlights well you know first game nice team but these just highlights, really. Like, I was just saying, this was when Kana Hoglu just was like, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, he just did him dirty. He did him dirty. And then look, ah. But, you know, I'm starting to get better with, like, all this whole, this whole like, different parts of it. So, you know, different tackles and goals and, you know, just like, I keep saying, you know, that's the one thing. Like, people have mentioned it. I say, as you can see, and, you know, just too much. So every time I say it, well, well, let's play a game. Every time I say it in the next couple of videos, or this video, cut, put down in the comments the number and then say, that's how much, I don't know, punches you owe me next time you see me. I know that sounds absolutely stupid, but if you've watched it this far and you've heard that, you know, you're lucky. I see, so I said it once then. But we won that game 1-0 and this is the second game. You know, it's a nice time. But, obviously, look, this is annoying. Look, how is that a penalty? But si big man, Sarah Goo, boom. Some of these games are a little bit laggy, which was annoying. Because, obviously, foot champions, you have to have, like, Liga on your bench and on your team. And I want to play Kelsey at team. But let me know, like, what other ideas. Obviously, I've told you what ideas. I'm so so happy that we can do the 12,000 thief points because if we get someone good decent then we we could do we could do well we might be able to do well and th this game oh i don't know what happened the game the team just like clicked just like that it was so nice and then that was a weird volley that was a very weird volley like, how that bounced. but look at that pass by abate oh and look out of nowhere boom it was unbelievable. But if you have enjoyed, like 
and subscribe. And let me know what different things you would like to change about me or like different things you'd like me to do. And I will leave you with the videos now. Well, you'll still be in the background. But let me know what are the amounts of coins you've got and if you enjoyed this team. But it was a very overpowered team. So, yes, yeah, so if you've enjoyed, leave a like. Remember to hit the subscribe button. Because if you do that, it won't go red. It will go grey. But I'll see you on the next video. See ya. Goodbye.